Hey farmers, what's going on? Welcome back to another Haiti hey video and in this video we're gonna do a little gameplay and also check out a really weird farm in Haiti. And is it gonna be the worst farm ever? I don't know. Let's see. So I'm just gonna start the game. The first thing I'm gonna do, I'm gonna harvest my rice and all right, there we go. I knew that I had a boat here. Yeah, we do. So nine hours left on the boat and I need more of these rice noodles, which I don't have. Let me have a look here. Yep, somebody donated me a lot of salad. So Betty Boop, thank you so much for the salads. I really appreciate you. Oh, you need help. Let's see if I can help you. Wow, that's level 185. It's funny, I never noticed this person's level, but that's such a high level. That's amazing. So, um, I think it's a tree help. I don't know, maybe. Let's see. If I, I can't find this. I'm so bad at finding help. Well, I can't find any. Oh, that's nectar bush. There we go. There's more. Oh, I'm just so lazy. I'm just going to get back to my farm. I can't do that. So... All right, I'm just gonna fill the salads. These are the summer salads. Gonna do one of this, and we're gonna do two of these. And I'm just gonna be asking for help on the boat, and gonna advertise my shop with the with the peanuts. Yep, there we go. Two peanuts there. Let me have a look at the paper now. Oh, my poor sad dogs. I'm sorry, guys. I couldn't feed you. This really makes me sad. How are they walking? So depressed, so sad, like, like they just don't have anything else to do. Hey, get away from my ticket. Why are you standing on my ticket? Look at this dog. Honestly, that's crazy. They all are doing the same things. I don't know what's going on, actually. We just got some coins from the mystery box. I was gonna go to the paper and look for... Nope, there's still a lot of peanuts. So we're gonna be planning. Let's see what I can do. Oh, solo potatoes. So it's night time when I'm recording the video. I need to plant potatoes because they take a longer time. And I can go with, let's see, oh, I have so low rice. I need to make more rice because rice are is a crop that gets used a lot in the game, especially the sushi and in different things. So there we go. I'm just going to wait. Let's get to my town and just send the townies as usual. Because I've not been playing the town, so I just opened the chest, and so my sanctuary there. Let me have a look at my puzzle book. All right, five, and I'm going to get six now. So let's just send these townies away. And there's nothing much to do in the town nowadays, because I've not been playing my town, so I don't really come a lot here. I just come to send these townies away. That's all I'm going to do now. Alright, so I'm gonna send all away, and my train has gone. I'm gonna get back to my farm, and let's go to my fishing area and see what's going on in there. So, here is my fishing area, and I'm just gonna collect the fish, and we're gonna be making more fishing nets. So, let's just collect the fish. There we go. That's gonna be a lot of fish. I've been collecting a lot of fish, which is cool, because I can make a lot of products when I get back into the game normally. So, yep, that's it. I'm going to be putting more of the nets in there. Yep, there we go. And my tackle box is 260, but I'm not going to upgrade right now because I'm trying to focus on my silo, which I think is more important for me. So we're going to get back to my farm again and see what else is there to do. So um, my animals are there. Let's just collect my animals. So let's get started with the sheep forest. All right, there we go with the sheep. I'm gonna collect this last one as well, and all right, that's done. And then we have our pigs and bacon. So there we go. Gonna feed all my piggies, and now we have cows. So I'm just gonna collect all this milk. All right, let me just feed this. All right, there we go with this, and mm, that's cool. Wait, I don't have any goat feet. Oh my god, this is not cool. My goats are gonna stay hungry now. Yeah, what I can do. Okay, so I need to make more feed. We're gonna be putting cow feed. We're gonna be putting a lot of pig feed. We're gonna be putting the sheep feed. 
and I'm gonna be putting the goat feed in. Sorry goats, I can't do anything. You'll have to stay hungry for the whole time. Just gonna collect my peanuts. And I'm gonna be collecting the actual honeycombs. And let me see if I can feed my, yep, I can. So I'm gonna feed my pets. They've been hungry for a really long time. As you guys saw in the previous video, my white horse, she was literally getting depressed because I had not feed them. All right, so I, I think I don't have enough milk, but for me, it's really like a big challenge, but I can do anything. All right, there we go. Some of my cats are already asleep, so that's it. I'm just going to wake them up and get a lot of expansion items and XP. So I'm just going to wait now. And yay, my boat is done. Thank you so much to, I can't read the name though. So I just got a puzzle piece, the purple, oh, that's a blue voucher. And I need candles, pizza, kind of tough boat and soft bouquet. Let's see what I can do. Nope, I don't have any of the cotton fabrics. Let me just make some. I can't believe I have zero. I really don't know where did they go. And we have pizza and the lemon candle, which hopefully I'll be able to make. Yeah, we're gonna put more. I have zero cheese right now, which is sad. And then we need the lemon candle. Yep, gonna put a lot of these. So that's it. And just gonna wake up my horses. Let's see what we get. So we got one screw, bolt. Oh, that's an axe and a dynamite. Just got um, a land deed from my bunnies. That's a wood panel, screw, and a dynamite. And yay, I just got a plank and a bolt from my kittens. So I just need about, that's 37 more planks to upgrade my barn. Alright guys, now we're gonna go to that farm that I was talking about in this video. And I've been following that person for a very long time, I think more than years. And I just randomly got an idea to show you guys that farm. That farm is really something unusual that you normally would not see in any other farms. So there is that person, level 85, Oinkle Farm, and I have followed him for a very long time, as I earlier said. So here we are, and oh my god, what is this? What is even this? Like, like honestly, is this like a farm or maybe a jungle? And this person's level 85, and he has not even expended a lot of land. As you guys can see, there are two pieces of land there, and still a lot of land here. And he's in a neighborhood called as, uh, I can't read the name, that's Soy Wendy Rocks, maybe? And he's the leader of the neighborhood. There are so many low-level players. Maybe that's all his own farms, baby farms, maybe? And if you have a look, this person has only one likes count, which is insane, because I have not seen any farm having only one like, and that is even a level 85 farm, which is insane because people probably don't like his farm. And he has 192 followers, which is a lot. So this is really unusual, and the fact is that this person plays daily. I check his farm, he sells items. Wow, that's so cool. It's gonna get all of that. I'm so lucky. And you guys can see the field, the crops are planted, the machines are working, and I'm not even sure if this person has all the machines. The whole place is literally filled with trees. Like, what even happened? Like, has this person been so lazy that he literally stopped cutting the trees? Or, like, what? Is this, like, a magical farm? I don't know. I really have no idea. But this is the most weird farm I have ever seen. I've never seen something like this. This is insane. This person cannot even do any decoration. This person cannot even do whatever, like, he has not even a little space, and I can't even see all the machines, I'm not even sure if this person has all the machines, though, you guys can see that is probably the sugar mill, that is, like, the pie oven, and then he has the feed mill there, and then we can see the bakery is here, that's the cake oven, and I don't know if there's any more machines, like, what, and he don't even have any, he doesn't have any trees, this doesn't really make a lot of sense. This really does not make any sense to me. Where are the machines? Where are the trees? All the trees are literally dead, and this is like a mixture of the um, cacao trees, the apple trees, the dead apple trees. So maybe this person has tried to become a little creative, and he has tried to create something with all these dead, dead um, trees. And as you guys can see, it seems like there's something written with the dark apple trees on the light, dead shiny trees. I'm not even sure, but this is like, I don't even know what to call it. Like, is it being creative or is this being lazy that this person has not even cut a single dead tree? Or maybe this could be possible that this person has a lot of baby farms 
and this is just a farm, you know, for fun for this person because. As you guys can see, he is a leader and these are all the farms, so maybe that's his own farms and maybe he has trees on other farms. But this still doesn't make any sense to me. Why would a normal person do this? Like, dude, why? If you need saws, then um, trade, maybe? And yeah, there were not even a lot of fields, so this is something really crazy. And, wait, wait a minute, what? Hello, what's going on? This person has not even expanded the town, not even upgraded any buildings, not even over the sanctuary. This person is really, like, it's a mystery. Somebody please solve this mystery for me. I cannot comprehend what's going on in here. This person is level 85. He plays daily. He sells a lot of things. And still, his farm is like a jungle and his town is not even expanded. So this is very unusual. And to me, this does not make any sense. So, what do you guys think? Is this the worst farm in Haiti, or is this like the most creative farm in Haiti? Or have you ever seen something like this before in the game? Let me know in the comments what do you guys think. I love to read your comments, obviously. So, yeah, whatever is this, this is insane. This is crazy. I still don't know why a person would do this. Like, it doesn't make sense to me, at least. So, yeah, this is what I just wanted to show you guys, this farm. And I found this person... A long time ago in the newspapers, the newspaper is a really tricky thing, you can find so many abnormal, normal exceptions there. So yeah, that was it, I just wanted to show you guys this farm and wanted to talk about how this person manages this farm, how crazy and difficult it would be. So yeah, I normally don't like those kind of farms at all. I hate dead trees, I'm not going to be kidding, although I have a lot of dead trees right now, but as you guys know, I don't have enough time right now. I'm really busy in my studies and other works. So that is why I'm not cutting my dead trees. But once I get free, I'm going to come back to my game. I'm going to start playing daily as I used to. So I'm going to start cutting all my dead trees. I'm going to start managing my trees again. So that was it for this video. I just wanted to show you guys that farm. I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. And um, I will see you guys soon. Later. Thank you so much for watching. Bye.